Hello friends and family, welcome back to the channel, Stephen here. It's that time of year again, it is time for the third annual USAC Group Build Unified Scale Auto Content Creators. This will be the third year they've built this, will be the first year that I've been able to jump in on it. On the first year was invitation only, I didn't have a kid anyway. But my dad and I were inspired so much by that, you know, that we decided to do a buddy build with a similar kit which started a tradition of an annual buddy build with my dad. Um, first year they built the AMT 1940 Ford kit. My dad had a couple of Lindbergh 40 Ford coupe kits, so we built those as a buddy build because we were so inspired by that. Here's a couple of pictures of those. Now last year I wasn't able to get in on it because I was just working too many hours and I just didn't have the time to do it. I did not have a kit, but Ravel was kind enough to re-release this beauty. And I like this kit anyway. I like that car. So I went ahead and picked one up. I just haven't built it yet. But this year, we're building the Ravel or Monogram 19, uh, 124 scale 1955 Ford F100. Either the truck or the panel van. But I didn't have a kit, so I ordered one up from Hobby Nut Models. It came in just a few days. And here we go. I'm going to try to get in on it this year. I'm looking forward to cracking this open and building it. Head on over to Hobby Nut Models. They've got a discount. If they have any of these left, they've got a discount uh, code that you can put in, and you can get these for 20 bucks plus shipping. My dad and I have not done our annual buddy build this year, so I think we're going to uh, do that two rocks with one bird thing. <laughs> yeah, I'm backwards, I know. But uh, he likes the 50s Ford trucks too. So he has ordered and gotten his in as well. He's going to be building this along with me. We're going to use this as our buddy build and the group build entries. So what we will do, since he doesn't have a channel, what I usually do is I will show progress reports and updates on his as I show mine. Not sure how he's going to build his, but I've got a pretty good idea of what I'm going to do with mine. This kit is a 124 scale, so there's not a lot of 124 scale spare parts that I have. And it comes with, uh, if I'm not mistaken, it comes with independent rear suspension. It's been a while since I've seen one of these. It's been a while since I've built one. So I am going to use that and go with a modern pro touring type. If you watched my last video, Stash Ed video, you've seen these two engines before. I'm going to use one of these two, I'm not sure which yet, from the Fargy Cypress over on Etsy. The 3D printed GT500 engine or the modern 5.0 Coyote out of a modern Mustang. Now you have seen these wheels before. But it's been a while. Last year, we had a shop truck group bill going that I didn't get to get in on. Actually, it was uh, year four last, sorry. And I bought these and was going to build a Reveal 66 Suburban using these wheels. Never got around to building that, so I've still got these wheels, and I think this is going to look perfect for this project. So that's what I've got in mind anyway. Lowered stance, uh, modern drivetrain, hot rod. As you can see, it's a sealed kit, never been opened. I've been in a building slump, so I'm, I'm pretty anxious to get on this one to get me out of the slump. Uh, you know, I haven't built uh, this kit in years. It was way before the house fire in 2011. <laughs> I started to say I haven't built a, a fat fender truck in a while, but I built this 50, 1950 Ford F1 last year, I think. Anywho. Look for updates in the near future. I would like to take a moment to thank all of my subscribers. Everybody who watches, likes, shares, comments. You guys are the very best part of YouTube and you're greatly appreciated. Uh, this is the best community on YouTube in my opinion. So I hope everybody's having a great weekend. See you in the next video. Hold up.
Hello.